My Google Science Fair project is about the thresholds of unique pinwheels with different configurations. In order to do well during this project, I had to learn the terms and concepts such as threshold sensitivity, input, output, symmetry, and asymmetry. All these terms were needed to ensure the understanding of my project. The overall question I decided to base my entire project upon was how does the number of blades affect the threshold of sensitivity towards a, diff a pinwheel through its asymmetrical and symmetrical features. My hypothesis was if the number of blades of a pinwheel is decreased, yet not so decreased that it is left with minimal blades, then the threshold of sensitivity will be at its maximum. During my research, I discovered that every person is different and that they all have their own unique thresholds towards different things. In addition, this can relate to my project through the pinwheel and its input of wind and its output of a unique threshold. My testing process was first, I took a pinwheel and put it in between two cushions to keep it stable. Then I took the tape measure and extended it from the pinwheel to the opposite wall. Next, I connected my hair blow dryer to the cord extender, which was connected to the outlet. As each trial was done, I got rid of a blade by cutting it with a pair of scissors. I discovered several things through my experiments. First, I discovered symmetry is more important than asymmetry. Moreover, I discovered that symmetry is more important than the number of blades that was on the pinwheel. Finally, the biggest difference of thresholds was the first two trials. In conclusion, my results have shown that a symmetric pinwheel with eight blades contains the highest threshold. However, a symmetric pinwheel with four blades contains a threshold that is as near as nearly high. There is always room for more research and my mission to finding a windmill con that contains the most efficient configuration is still not over.